Good morning, everybody. And breaking news this morning out of Washington. And ugly new questions about the jobs created or saved under the almost $800 billion stimulus program. Fox News confirming that the White House job site reporting thousands of jobs in congressional districts that do not exist in America or Puerto Rico. I'm Bill Hemmer. Welcome here to America's Newsroom. Nice to have you with us back today, Thanks Allie. Thanks so much, It makes sense of this, will you? Uh, Give I it can't. a shot. I need a calculator. I'm <laughs> Allison Camerata in for Megyn Kelly. How bad is this mess? Well, let's look at it. In the state of Arizona, for example, the recovery.gov website is reporting jobs in the 9th, 11th, 18th, 25th, 29th. I've got more. 36, 38th, 40th, 50th, 52nd, 78th, and 86th congressional districts. Bingo! But there's one problem. Take a look at this map. You see anything missing? Yeah, Arizona only has eight districts. <laughs> so there could not have been any jobs saved in the 12 other districts they list. Uh, you gave a good shot at it, didn't you? Uh -huh. What's going on here, Stu Varney, Fox Business? Now, what is going on here, Stu? Tip of the iceberg, Bill. Absolutely tip of the iceberg. You think this is restricted to Arizona? Wrong. Take a look at this map, please. The government is claiming jobs created in nine Oklahoma congressional districts. Problem, there's only five. Jobs in eight districts of Iowa. Big problem, there's only five. Jobs in eight districts in Connecticut. Again, there's only five. Jobs in three congressional districts in the Virgin Islands. There is only one. And as you point out, Bill, Puerto Rico. The government claims 17,544 jobs created or saved in six congressional districts. There is only one congressional district in Puerto Rico. I don't know if we should be laughing or crying no. over this. I mean, Puerto Rico alone, 99th congressional district, 98th congressional district, a no-number congressional yes. district. I mean, good Lord. Yes, yes, yes. Raise your eyebrows, please. Look, it's very bad, very unreliable statistics, and it really undermines all of these claims, these gross claims of job creation from stimulus. And let's not forget, Bill, it comes on top of the Boston Globe saying that job claims for Massachusetts, wildly exaggerated, 26,000 jobs in California saved. Nonsense. They were never threatened in the first place. Wisconsin, the AP revelations from around the country. Georgia Head Start program. Give employees a raise and call it a created job. It's the drip, drip, drip of declining credibility for the stimulus plan just as Congress is discussing and pushing stimulus plan two. More, two. two more points to make on this. Yep. And you wonder if that ever gets momentum when stories like these break. Uh, many would argue this is what happens when you create $787 billion in spending in 21 days, as was the case earlier in the year. Also, if you go to the website, recovery.gov, it's responsible for managing and putting out the word on this. It says that it relies on local information reported to the website. So what recovery, the, what, what the White House is saying is that the information came from the states that did not come from us, and now we're doubling back to make sure that the numbers are right, and clearly they have not been right, Stuart. Yeah, well, whoop to do it talks about the difficulties of getting accurate reporting from a government bureaucracy, which is actually politically motivated, Bill. Thank you, Stu. See you next hour, okay? Yep. Stu Varney, what are we going to uncover next? Uh, as Stu was uh, saying there, a comment from Reaction and key lawmakers now uh, talking about this. Chairman of the powerful House Appropriations Committee, uh, that's a Democrat out of Wisconsin, David Obey. He says the following, quoting now, credibility counts in government and stupid mistakes like this undermine it. Whether the numbers are good news or bad news, I want the honest numbers and I want them now. Also working for some reaction at the White House as well. As that comes in, we will bring it to you. Alice.